Hey, it's CJ again. Um, this little segment is just going to just talk about three things that I think men need to have in their daily grooming uh, regimen. Um, yeah. Hey, it's CJ. Hi, CJ Magruder. Anyway, back to what I was talking about. First thing I think that a man should always have is powder. Um, most of us men, we sweat a lot and uh powder can be used to absorb uh a lot of uh different odors make you even feel better like i ride my bike so a lot so at the end of the day i like to put powder in my drawers put it in, in my shirt people always say that i smell fresh i never really had a complaint about my hygiene so i think that you know you having a problem with some odors or you sweating a lot put some powder it's a, a very pe pleasant smell um Another thing that a lot of us men miss is uh, just daily face moisturizer. I'm using right now Dr. Miracle. I really like all of their products. Um, but basically, of course, you want a SPF 15, you know, protect you from the sun, even though you're black or maybe ethnic, you know, the sun does still damage our skin. So you still want to get a good face moisturizer, even if you have sensitive skin. I really like this because I have sensitive skin and it works. It has uh, vitamin E, vitamin A. A lot of us need to get a little more vitamin E in our system. Um, helps with blood blemishes and making your skin look great so find you a good face moisturizer it'll help especially after uh getting shaved and if you have you know razor bumps and stuff like that so check that out the last thing you need a good vitamin and i'm saying b12 i'm not representing kroger or whatever but this is a, a lower brand i i didn't get to go to gnc but i went and i went and got my b12 b12 is something that's needed for energy and a lot of us lack a lot of energy so uh us men, as we get older, we need to make sure that we're taking the proper vitamins. I believe that vitamins are the true uh, answer to good health. Um, I think that the drugs that they make for us uh, are set up to kill us. And that's why most people who are on these vitamins are doing well and, you know, really whatever. I think these are the true medicine. So, hey, preventative health.